we are going to cook dinner, but I've been uh, teaching my teenager how to cook, cook quick meals. So we are going to, Ava, I'm recording. <laughs> we are going to uh, do burgers and fries tonight. Um, but first, first things first in our home, in terms of being able to cook, I gotta have a clean uh, cooking space. So the kiddos are straightening up the kitchen because it's their responsibility, uh, unloading the dishes, uh, getting the counters taken care of, and wiping the counters off so we can have a nice clean space to actually do our cooking. Um, so yeah, that's what we're gonna do. As I said, teaching our 13 year old how to get some meals under her belt so that as she um, prepares for her family or even just while we have our younger kids, she can help them um, not help them while we have the younger kids and sometimes me, mom and dad can't cook to, for whatever reason it gives her opportunity to come in here and whip something up that she can do so that's what everybody's doing right Ava? empty it out empty it out um, empty, yeah, empty it out in the, in the, in the uh, disposal you gotta unmantle it yeah dis disassemble it Okay, your brother should be able to get it, hopefully. Yeah. Just straighten up so we can get the cooking. Okay, hands are all washed. Go ahead and get your ground turkey. And let's get it in the bowl. Actually, let's do, um, get a knife so you can cut it. We're gonna do half that ground turkey. That's about one and a half pounds. That should be plenty for what we're gonna do. So we're gonna do sliders tonight using Hawaiian bread. So hold on, so your hands are all clean. So keep in mind, when you touch different stuff, you have to make sure you rewash your hands so you don't cross contaminate. So the easiest thing before you touch the meat, go ahead and set your, um, look at your bag for your fries, set your thermometer temperature, and get all the pots and pans you need out. It's gonna be fries, then you're gonna do your bread, and then you're gonna do your actual burgers. Get you a, yep, get you a pan for probably one of the, yeah, that one should fit. You get, that pan needs to be cleaned out too. That pan is a little gross. Need to be cleaned out, washed out.
would you record that? To show how that So is I just trying to teach how to cook and we drop the I dropped the whole shelf. Oh, and it's my everywhere. God. Lord have mercy. Dang it. It's Okay, after my big snafu, I was trying to get seasoning and drop the whole cabinet. So, anywho, I will fix that, but trying to keep dinner moving. So, let me get the ladder this time. But in short, just simple ingredients. Nayla is getting the meat and stuff ready. Just simple ingredients of Worcestershire sauce and salt and just a little bit of um, a dry rub, a sweet dry rub we like to use, just really simple ingredients. And we're gonna make um, sliders that she's going to actually put on the grill and cook them. So our bread is all pretty much done. We put turned it off with our little snap food, but just like to have bread grilled a little bit, the slider bread, um, curly fries, which are done. and then the actual slider. And that's a very simple meal that she's gonna make for us and get all done so we all can eat. All right, after everything is said and done, here is our meal. And Nayla helped prepare. We, we shredded some cheese and some lettuce. And we got a little bit of bacon on the side, but those are our sandwiches. Those are our bread, nice and toasted, our fries. So we can go ahead and make our sliders. Nayla did a really good job. All right, guys, come on so everybody can eat and we can watch some football.